I'm John Walsh, and this is The Missing. Calling all available units, calling all available units. We have a missing child report at the corner of 1st and 2nd Avenue. Respond with emergency traffic. The Missing is brought to you in part by Quiznos of Crossville and Hughes Real Estate Services. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of The Missing. I'm your host Scott Davis and I'd like to say thank you so much for joining us. As always here on The Missing, we bring to your attention the cases of missing children. We turn to you, our viewers, in hopes that you can help us bring in these children home safely. On this week's episode, we have the cases of two missing children. One, the case of Jalik Rainwalker, missing out of New York. And the other is a little girl by the name of Lindsay Baum, missing out of Washington State. So let's don't waste any more time. Let's get right into their cases. Our first case is that of Jalik Rainwalker, missing out of Greenwich, New York. Now his case is different than anything else we've ever covered here on The Missing due to the fact that he has so many different family members that care about his whereabouts and want to bring him home safely. I was contacted by one of his foster parents and they asked us to help bring Jalik home safely. Since the contact with his family, I have talked with the Chief of Police at Greenwich Police Department. He and I agreed by putting exposure to Jalik's case here on The Missing may help bring him home safely. So we turned to you, our viewers, and asked for your help. The case of Jalik Rainwalker. Now, as I mentioned, this is a very unique case to the missing because of the circumstances behind him missing. If you will, take the opportunity, review the information that we're going to present to you, and look at the photographs that we're going to show you. As always, you can visit our website at missing.tv to gain more exposure to his case, look at more photographs, and connect to media links that have covered his case in the past so you can work together with us here on the missing and bringing him home safely. Let's get into the information in Jalik's case. Jalik Rainwalker is 12 year old, missing out of Greenwich, New York. He has a light complexion, golden brown hair, tight curls, and green eyes. As you look at these photographs, you will see a bright, beautiful smile and a very energetic young man. Now Jalik is a product of the foster care system and he has a lot of family members that really care about him. He was last reported seen on November 1st, 2007. The family states that Jalik was wearing a yellow fleece pullover, a gray t-shirt with a dragon on the front of it, blue jeans and black canvas high tops. He may use the nickname Jay and he has a speech impediment with a difficulty pronouncing R's like W's. At the time of his missing he was wearing a two inch afro hairstyle. If you will, look at the information that we're going to present to you. Look at his photographs. If you've seen this child, or you feel that you've seen this child, please feel free to contact us. We here on The Missing want to work together closely with his family and the investigators in his case, and you, our viewers, in bringing him home safely. As I mentioned, we were contacted by one of his foster parents. She cares for Jalik very much because she was part of Jalik's early life, and she wants to see Jalik return home safely. We really appreciate you taking the opportunity and reviewing this information in Jalik's case, and hopefully we can work together here on, on The Missing and bringing him home safely. If you have any information in Jalik's whereabouts, you can contact the National Center at 1-800-THE-LOST, or you can contact the Greenwich Village Police Department in New York at 518-692-9332. Folks, let's work together in bringing Jalik home. The next case I'd like to bring to your attention is that of Lindsay Baum, a 10-year-old female missing out of Washington State. She was reported missing on June the 26th while returning home. I talked to one of the investigators in her case and he said any exposure that we can gain for Lindsay here on the missing would be helpful. But keep in mind, their search and rescue efforts are not extending out of the state of Washington right now because they do not believe that she's out of the state. But we are an internet program, so if you believe that you've seen Lindsay anywhere in the United States or anywhere in the world, please feel free to contact us with information so we can help bring her home safely. So let's don't waste any more time. Let's review the case of Lindsay Baum. The case of Lindsay Baum. Lindsay was last seen on June 26, 2009, when she was leaving a friend's house to take a 10-minute walk home. 
She was last seen wearing a light blue hooded pullover shirt and blue jeans. If you will, look at the photographs of Lindsay and listen to the information, as little as it may be, that we're providing you in her case. Also, you can visit our website at themissing.tv for updated information and links to other sites that will help you locate Lindsay. The McCleary Police Department, along with the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children and the FBI, are working diligently to search for Lindsay and bring her home safely. If you have any information about Lindsay's whereabouts, please contact the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children at 800-THE-LOST or you can contact the McCleary Police Department at 360-533-8767. Let's work together in bringing Lindsay home safely. Well, everyone, that brings it close to another episode of The Missing. I really appreciate you taking the time and reviewing the cases that we presented to you here in this episode. Jalik Rainwalker and Lindsay Baum really need our help. If you will, please visit our website at themissing.tv for further information on these cases, and hopefully we can work together here on The Missing and bringing them home safely. As always, keep your children educated, keep them protected, and continue to watch The Missing. I'm your host, Scott Davis. God bless.